Welcome, welcome to Dirt. A short narrative experience. Apparently it's potentially spooky or interesting. Looked interesting. Let's just get into it. All right. Finally, a piece of land of my a piece of land of my very own. I know I can make this work. I just had to put in the effort. Got to sow the fields. Yeah. That should do it for now. It won't be long before I'm taking the first harvest to market. Soon I may be even able to buy another field. But for now, I must rest. Yes, yeah, one thing at a time in this barren-looking wasteland. Or at least what looks like a barren wasteland. Ugh. Oh, there goes my crops. That's some heavy-ass base going down. I don't know, this doesn't look good. Why doesn't it look good? It weathered rotten! What is going on here? Now I just have to sow the next crop and this plot will be ready. Well, first I like to... I guess I can sow it first, then I can harvest the other ones. Alright, let's harvest the good ones. This one is okay, that's something I guess. And then let's sow some more on the same plot. Well, maybe the next crop will do better. I should try to stay optimistic. Well, let's go to sleep. See what happens the next day. Also, what were those things that were in the background that aren't in the background during the nighttime? They all look bad. Uh oh. Oh. You know, just these ghostly things like from, uh, this is even worse than before. It's, uh, making me think of, um, uh, Courage the Cowardly Dog. That kind of, like, isn't that, like, if any of you have watched Rotten Again, how am I going to pay my debts at this rate? If any of you grow up watching Courage the Cowardly Dog, does this feel like it a bit? Like in the middle of nowhere and just weird crap is happening. How am I going to look after my family? So many people are depending on me. Well, maybe you should buy better seeds from a better uh, distributor. Not a single healthy stock. This land is poison and it's going to poison me. I should never have come here. Yeah, you know, but you're still sowing the fields. So, you know, you could just, like, leave. I don't know what else I can do. Definitely nothing for today. Hmm. By the way, the game uh, on the top of the screen, since it's in windowed mode, the game is called Dirt. But on the top left it says, Always Dying. Which might be important to know. I can't keep going like this. Why even bother? 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 The end. The end, what? What? Oh. I was expecting for something more climactic. What do you mean, the end? That's a horrible waste of potential. It, that's not how stories work. It's supposed to be, you know, a, sh a slow... Slow build up to the peak. You get a climax. And then everything goes to hell. You you do it like that. You don't just be like, oh, the roller coaster's going up. It's it's building the tension. Game that the end. You don't do it like that. What are you doing? As the game store, as the game store. Let's read the game store so you guys even know what I got into before downloading it. All right. So let's see. A short narrative experience about an ecological and personal catastrophe developed over 48 hours for the Alaka Jam. Alka, Alka Jam 3 Game Jam 
If you participate in the jam, the audio is loud and intentionally abrasive. Turn down your audio if you have sensitive ears. I was expecting uh, actual loudness, but that was just like deep bass, that's all. Click on the dirt to perform the planting and harvesting in the day, then click on the shack to end the day. Click to advance dialogue. I was, I was just expecting more. Something climactic. Something like, you know, the farmer dies, even. Even the ha farmer hanging himself. Like, anything, really. Anything. But just the end. I know there's a time restraint of 48 hours, but you couldn't have shoved in even a very quick... He just kills himself the end. Like I said, anything would really do in that point, because whatever's happening to his farm, uh, catastrophe-wise, it's just... He just says, why bother, and then goes in his house to sleep again. You could you could think the potential of him just killing himself or something else happens, but since it doesn't show it, it sort of ruins the narrative experience. But either way, outside of that, I hope you enjoyed this game. It's a very, very short narrative game. I was, I was hoping where there's some kind of climactic way that'd make you go, ooh, spicy. But there's no spice, not none at all for a horror game. So, a little disappointed, I will admit. But I hope you enjoyed for what it offered it very for a very short narrative experience. I don't know, man. But if you did enjoy, please leave a like, comment, hit that subscribe button, 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 button,